Okay, so I wanted to show how to capture from an Xbox Series S or Series X onto a USB device, just because it's more handy and also you can record for longer. I tried this Arcanite USB stick, which is only 128 gig, and unfortunately it formats less than 128, so it doesn't work. So this is a 240 gig SSD drive with a USB to SATA cable. So I'm gonna plug that in and show you how it works. Okay, so first step, you need to plug your drive into a PC, uh, a Windows PC. So let's plug that in and you can hear that's identified. There's a problem with this disc, we don't need to worry about that. Uh, so if I now go down to the disc, this is the disc, it's uh, labelled as E at the moment. So let's hit format. On the previous Xbox you had to do, uh, had to uncheck quick format which takes absolutely ages. It doesn't seem to need that on this. So as long as your formatting is NTFS, just hit start and hit OK. And that's done. Quite why the Xbox can't do this task, I have no idea. Um, surely Microsoft could build this into the Xbox Series S or Series X to be able to do this so you didn't have to go over to a Windows PC. You might not have a PC at all. Uh, you could probably do it within Linux, there's probably a program you can install, or in Mac OS, but you know, these extra steps, there's no need for this. Okay, so now we need to go over to the Xbox. So let's plug it in and we can switch over to screen capture then. Okay, so it's recognized the drive. So I've tried formatting the storage device uh, and that tends to mess it up. So if you do use for media. Okay, so now it says media storage ready. Okay, so strangely for this next step, uh, we actually go back to the PC that we formatted the drive on and plug it back in again. It's important to do the Xbox bit because the Xbox now recognizes that as a drive, but if you try to do anything, it will say, well, it's not NTFS and it won't let you use it, which is really weird. So anyway, uh, it's saying there's a problem with the drive. We're not gonna worry about that. Uh, we're gonna go down to E and right click and hit format. And we're gonna do exactly the same again, quick format and just hit start. It doesn't take very long. So now we should be good to go on the Xbox. It seems to be that it knows the name of the drive now, uh, and so it recognizes the drive as a usable drive. Okay, so if I plug my drive in now, you'll see that it's recognized. If we go to settings, and capture and share. There you go, so the capture location is showing up. You might find an easier way of doing this for some reason, I had to do these extra steps. I couldn't get it to work otherwise. Uh, so game clip resolution is still only 1080p. I guess that's because it's uh, it's internally saved on the Xbox and then it will save it to the USB stick. But I'm hoping that actual captures will come at a higher resolution. So let's go into a game and see what it does. So something that, that upscales to 4K, so something like, something like Fortnite. So let's press the home button go over to capture and start recording. Okay, so that's now recording onto the SSD drive. Okay, so because I'm screen capturing on the Xbox and I'm also capturing on my capture device, I'll be able to compare the two side by side. So I'll put uh, which one is the Xbox on the left and I'll put the Ava Media Capture on the right uh, we can see if one looks better than the other because hopefully the Xbox Capture will capture with HDR because my Ava Media says it doesn't do HDR. Never any weapons is there? Oh, get out. How, how did he get a weapon so quick? <laughs> so, I'm off. What does that bit do? I don't know what that does. Oh, okay. <laughs> that probably wasn't worth doing. Let's just run around for a bit and give you an idea of which one looks the best. Maybe jump in a car. 
I have to keep pressing the button because uh, obviously I don't want... Oh, that's nice. Okay, I've got out of the car because it wants to play music all the time. go well that's nice <laughs> I quite like those Surely there's someone about to come through. Oh! 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 I think he's dead anyway. There's always loads of people around. I worked it out as well. It's about 500 megabytes per five minutes. So 100 megabytes a minute, I guess. But uh, that could vary on depending on what game you're playing. So. so thanks very much for watching. Please like and subscribe.